All right, hey folks. Um, just before I move my hand, you can start seeing stuff again. We've got an energy drink review here. Now, um, over the weekend, I found some that are now sold out my way, but you only can get them at a sports check store. So I bought some of those, potentially, maybe. And then there's a store that's like, you know, probably about a 20 to maybe 30 minute the most drive away in another nearby city. And um, they seem to get, you know, a um, lot more flavors of Fago and different sizes. And they have like all these different like uh, Mountain Dew drinks and different Arizona drinks and whatnot. And sometimes they'll have the odd different energy drink. But I find with this store, <clears throat> sure they charge a little more than what the prices should cost because they're listing Arizona cans as like $1.49 and they have the 24 ounce and 2 liter Fagos they don't get the 710 milliliter bottle sent to them so they don't have the 99 cents price for not right in the bottle and then they're charging like $1.49 I think for those little bottles but they get a huge different selection of flavors and every now and then you can find maybe two or three different energy drinks that are in there that you'd have to like only find somewhere in the states or whatever so there's going to be some like future stuff for reviews but they're not like cold and ready yet plus I want them over the holidays so um, there's an energy drink called Red Rain made by a uh, or sorry Red Rave made by Cots and with Red Rave all it is is the Cots will sell it in a store where they're not selling their product Red Rain and Red Rave is the exact same drink as Red Rain, except for the fact that they added a little slight sourness to it to make it a bit different. Now, normally you can get the cans for $1.69. So I thought, okay, I'll pick up a Red Rave and this other one next to it that I've not had before. And then in this video, quickly like chug the Red Rave back and go into the other one. But, nope. They wanted like two something for them, so it's like, nope, I'm just going to get the one, because they're not worth paying over $1.69. It's better if you can pay $1.69 or less. But anyways, the other stuff I have for reviews will be in like over the holidays and whatnot. But we got Red Rave's um, blue palm drink here with taurine, so it's blueberry pomegranate. It's a 250 milliliter 8.5 ounce can. It has 1,000 milligrams of taurine, 80 milligrams of caffeine. Then for the vitamins, they just give you 5 milligrams of B6 and 5 of B12. Um, yeah, and there's really nothing else you need to know. Except it's from COTS. Or COTS, C-O-T-T. And yeah, let's get into reviewing it. One sec, folks. Whoa, that looks purple. Yeah, it looks very purple. I think I might have seen this one a couple of times before. But I don't know how many red rave flavors there is. And yeah, let me uh, just keep showing you that the can, I guess. Red rave blue palm. It's a purple drink, as y'all can see. Um, Smell-wise, I can smell little bits of blueberry and some pomegranate, and then I get like a sugar smell. But everything's done lightly there. So you don't smell great, but you smell sugar, pomegranate, and blueberry, and I'm going to drink some now. Um, half my mouth feels like it's a dry drink, the other half of my mouth feels like, yeah, I can taste the wetness to it. As I'm taking in that sip, all I'm really tasting is blueberry, and maybe, yeah, when I'm taking that sip, I just taste blueberry and pomegranate a little bit, but then... After I swallow that sip, I don't taste it a lot anymore, but when I am tasting, 
almost tastes like a very, very lightly sour blueberry juice almost. So, this one isn't anything special. It's not terrible. But it's nothing to, you know, write home about. So, uh, No, it's not terrible, but it's nothing special to write home about. So just 1.8 out of 5. Whatever it is what it is. Thank you. Peace.